The clock is ticking again. A deadline for a state budget is looming again. 24 Hour News 8 political reporter Rick Albin spent the day in Lansing following a familiar theme. Just over two weeks ago, I stood right here and told you about that looming deadline for a budget. Well, the deadline came and went. There is a temporary budget, but there is still no permanent plan. So I went to two principals in the state Senate today to find out exactly what the problem is. Well, there's no holdup. We've got spending bills, uh, appropriation bills that have been passed, and uh, we're waiting right now to uh, send them to the governor because we're trying to work out final details. In the middle of the whole process, after we had a bipartisan, bicameral agreement, we passed all the bills. She uh, made it very clear that she wasn't happy with what we had agreed to. What we're trying to do now is to try to identify those areas where she's concerned and see if we can resolve them before we send them to her. I think the uh, Senate Republicans are afraid that if they send the budgets to the governor now, she might veto the whole budget and then say to the legislature, I don't like that budget, come up with another one. You got two weeks. Whereas if they hold on to it to the uh, last day, then the governor's choice is, gee, if you veto this whole budget, we have no budget. We're back in a shutdown. So it's harder to veto the whole budget. Personally, I don't think it's really realistic that she would veto whole budgets even if you gave them to her now. She could use her line item veto, though. I think it's uh, maybe too clever by a half, the two uh, not being able to get together. Both of the senators we talked to today say they do not think that they will have to have another continuation budget when they come down to the October 30th deadline. But remember, virtually every legislator we talked to before the September 30th deadline said the same thing. By the way, both Senator Switalski and Senator Bishop will be my guests this week on To the Point. 10 o'clock, Sunday morning on Wood TV 8.